Like I'm the first ever flesh and blood Pro Tour champion. I'm Pablo Pintor. I came from Spain, from a little town in Madrid called Aranjuez. And I have won the first Pro Tour of the Flesh and Blood organized play. And <laughs> I'm feeling incredible right now. Like, I still cannot fully realize what I have achieved, I believe. Like, um, I'm incredibly happy, but I still cannot process all, all of that's happening to me right now. So, yeah, I'm incredibly, incredibly happy and grateful. My name is Matt Rogers. Uh, I'm from New Zealand, and I'm here to play the first Flesh and Blood Pro Tour. Uh, whole event's been great. I ended up 15th place, uh, so top 16 at a pro tour, which uh, definitely happy with that. And um, yeah, I've just had an amazing weekend to be honest. So I'm, I'm uh, yeah, I'm, I'm hyped at the moment. I'm, I'm in a good place. You know, we've still got a calling going on. I don't know how many people, but I know it's a lot. And that's going to be day two of the calling. You know, they're going to be playing right up to top eight, and then also top eight of the pro tour is happening. Uh, I'm going to be commentating on that, so I'm, I'm super stoked and proud. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just very uh, appreciative that they're inviting me on to commentate on that. I had a lot of fun doing that at nationals, uh, US nationals, so it's, it's going to be a gr another great day for me, I think. So I didn't even like imagine topping the event because uh, we switched in our locals, the one, only one I go to, we switched to Blitz after the ProQuest season. And uh, I didn't get like any games in on Prism or in CC since like March 5th, I think. That's when I uh, qualified by winning a, a PQ. I don't know, we'll, we'll, see how, we'll see how it goes, I guess. I'm into chain, the only chain in top eight, like the hardest matchup. <laughs> So I need to get lucky a couple more times. I, I had a pretty rough start at this tournament. I lost my first two rounds. I had to win almost every, every other game. And yeah, I'm playing in the top eight in the Pro Tour. I'm so happy that I was able to make the cut. I will play against Prism in my first matchup. So let's hope it goes well. But yeah, just being here is, is, is already a blessing. So I'm pretty happy with it. I was uh, a bit lucky because I believe uh, one person with X3 uh, got cut down. So yeah, I was hoping that uh, <laughs> I was not that that person. But yeah, that was uh, that was pretty good. I, I had a lot of really exciting games. I even got to play with Matt Rogers, so that was an experience. <laughs> I'm playing a chain deck. I usually main Bravo Showstopper, but I was tired of losing against Prism because one of my best friends uh, plays Prism and, and I was losing to him each, every tournament. I needed to get a ton of games with him because I'm really bad at math and playing against fatigue was, was uh, so mentally draining that, that I was not feeling confident. I played like a ton of games and, and yeah, I finally fell in love with his play style and, and uh, how he offers you so many decision paths in, into the, each game, and yeah, and he's amazing. He will be living lion pretty soon too. <laughs> Thank you.
Both of these Tarbo matchups were pretty rough. They were pretty close games. And I would say the finals. The finals was a fierce battle, yeah. Could have gone either way. So proud of that game, to be honest. It was a great game. Congratulations to my opponent too. And he also made the finals of the Pro Tour, so he must be happy too. Uh, when I dropped to one life, I had to play with my bunnies for one turn and it was either win or die. And, and yeah, it was a pretty stressful situation. Pretty amazing. Yeah, of course, at first it's disappointing to lose. It's being so close and then falling short is upsetting. But I think it was still a fantastic result. I'm very happy, uh, of course, everyone was cheering me on, that was great, uh, yeah, it's good, it's a good result and I'm glad that the trophy went to, is coming back to Europe after all the talk, let's say, before between uh, Oceania and North America, we now know where the trophy belongs. Look, shit bang, going my way for a hot sec, they want me to cool off, nigga. First of all, I need to cool off with, with my friends. Uh, I need uh, a few days uh, to pass to to really realize what has happened, I believe. <laughs> I need to celebrate with my family, my friends back in Spain, and then I am looking forward to every Flesh and Blood tournament, to be honest. I know I've got the money to, <laughs> to travel to them, so <laughs> expect to see me in a lot of them.